Asset Parental Control Web Service works in addition to the Asset Parental Control application that protects children from threats on their smartphones and tablets. A parent can either monitor a child's activity on the device or restrict its usage. When entering the Parental Control section, the user can see the children already added or easily add one. When adding a child, the user provides the name, gender and date of birth and can install the app on the mobile device or send the installation link by email. The first thing the user sees entering a child's profile are reports showing the details about device usage. Usage heat map, time budget or most used apps. A full report for a selected time period is available showing the exact time period per application. The home report screen also shows rules applied, history log or child's locator. In the Rules section, we can find two functions. The first one is the Application Guard, which allows the parent to block applications inappropriate for the child. All installed applications are listed and can be filtered by Time Limited, Unlimited or Blocked Restrictions or by Age Appropriate Groupings. Each app tag can be changed to restrict its usage. Time limits restrict the usage of a selected app only to a specific time period. It's divided into school and non-school days. It can be specified in 30-minute blocks. WebGuard is a second function in the Rules section. It checks whether the visited websites are appropriate. There are various categories that can be allowed or blocked. Also, three age groups can be selected to automatically adjust the settings. Of course, there can be exceptions to both categories when a child requests it. Both the Application Guard and Web Guard functions can be turned off and parental control used only for monitoring the child's usage of the device. In the Report section, the parent can see all the activities of the child's device, Application Guard and Web Guard restrictions, and usage. Also, most used apps, time heat map that shows when the device is used most, or visits of appropriate or inappropriate websites. The locator shows parents the map with the last location of the child. Alert zones can be specified. When the device will appear in such zone, a notification will be sent to the parent. The Devices section shows the information about child's mobile device and Profile section allows to change the name or picture as in the beginning. Among the Parental Control settings, there's an option to enter a parental PIN to secure the app, select the time period for email report and select the day when the week is starting. In the Alerts tab, the parent can select which activity will send a notification. Children Request then allows the child to ask for an exception, either for a web page, application or a time limit. In the License section, a parent can see the information about the license expiration date.